was playing in the final in Craven College? Um, I say meeting the new people there. For example, this guy oh. here. <laughs> um, all the dodgeball games, yeah. Celestia cheating. One of our best memories of Charter would be Mr. Pierce's kicks. In Blackjack, oh. that's not economics is actually the high point of my weeks. My best memory has been was winning the football final last year. Black, Black Jack, obviously. Black. It's a massive kind of thanks to all the teachers here because they're the ones who have brought us through everything. Oh hi! I was just um just uh, having a look at uh, the, uh, the 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 hopes and dreams of uh, the Year 13 students that I've had the pleasure of teaching this year. Very interesting what some of you wanted to do. Hmm, enjoy. Very polite. It's been a journey. You are fantastic. It's not been pleasant at all. You've been highly entertaining. They were lads, they were so lads. I'm fantastic. It's been a year of ups and downs. Very entertaining. I'm very proud and happy. Well, probably a little bit like Marmite. Uh, there's been a bit of love and there's been a bit of hate. Personally, I don't like Marmite. It's been an absolute pleasure. Uh, it's driven me slightly mad. Yeah, you've been really, really fantastic. You're a group. Students are always singing and dancing in uh, the cyber study area. And I'm so impressed with how well you all bake. Some of you refer to me as Queen D. Quite a lot of emotional ups and downs. Possibly the most cooperative year 13 I've taught in the charter school. Spent a lot of time contacting parents this year about smokers. I would never have thought of them as A level students. Very friendly. Um, very friendly. Easy to get along with. So what a lovely group of, of, of kids they are. It's been a, an interesting bunch, full of ideas, very creative. Girls, you've always had great names. Rex to kill. <laughs> Mainly on my part. Yeah, they're such amazing characters. You know, some of you I've not really seen Sebastian, unfortunately. It was a bit like a cross between a Call of Duty convention and a rugby club. They sort of like the Sebs, the Saras, the Gabriellas, um, the Evas, etc., etc., the Ralphs. The Berties, the Elliots, the Erin. Pussy, Marlo, Maeve, Eva, and Rachel. Tom Carter. Tom Carter's on my head in. We've got David Wildman and Colin Wally, Louis, uh, we've got Simmy. Hugo and Harvey. Who, who's that kid again? Oh, I remember. Who's it? David Colin Wally. Oh, God. Uh, Jasmine, Melissa, Leone, Kira, Maeve, uh, Miranda. Even Beth's your one, Molly Chalik's your one. Colin, the wonderful Colin. Ruby and Rachel. Uh, Joe McDonald. Sarah uh, Jeffrey. Larry. Joshua and Michael. Jackie, Jeffrey. Oh, and Gabriel, Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> Louis Duncan always seemed to be causing bother. Now he just seems like a really nice, polite, lovely human being. Uh, Suf, yeah, you, yeah, <laughs> you was a criminal mastermind when it comes to selling food. Mikey Robinson Turner, who spent quite a lot of year 12 with his head in his football kit bag, has just morphed into this wonderful essay writer. Daisy thought, took a look at me and thought, no, I don't think uh, this is going to work out. So, but you know, everybody else has been great, including Sebastian as well. The VTech class, there's some really nice students in there that worked really hard this year. Even Raja, who back in October handed in a piece of work, so well done for that, Raja. And I got a compassionate side as well. Uh, so, like when I had all my eye surgeries, they sent a get well soon letter to my house. Um, all these really nice messages. And then there was Joe McDonald's that just simply read, Aye, aye, Captain. The girls, pretty noisy at times. Mostly the girls, yes. The voice was alright. I enjoyed chatting with David Wildman about Hawaii Five-O, our shared favourite TV show. David Colawoli. I've had to work quite hard on managing his swearing tendencies. In with announcements, did I ever have to make them? No. Celestia was there making them for me. Don't forget this, miss. Don't forget that. All of you have so many talents and gifts to share with the world, so go out and do it. Sam, please pack your bag properly for school. Can you just shut up, get on with your work or leave? Jose, yeah, I'm glad you cut off that gold lot's hair, yeah? You look even better now, well done. Didn't we have a laugh?
Uh, I've really enjoyed uh, teaching you for the last two years. It has been a pleasure to be with that tutor group with 13R. It's been a great experience spending so much time with you. I remember when I first started Charter, you guys were in year seven, yeah, and uh, it's been such an amazing honour to see you guys finally leave this. I'm going to be sad to see some of you leave. Fantastic year group to work with, and I think they're really destined for really, really big things. Thank you for inspiring me so much to be the best I could be. It's been a pleasure to have you briefly, either in my form or to teach you. I wish you all the best in your studies in the future. My beloved 13S. I'll miss you all. You guys are off to university or apprenticeships or jobs or gap years for some of you wasting your time travelling around the world. I hope you have a fantastic time all of you. Wish you the very best of luck in your future and I'm sure you'll pop back and see it. I've had like close relationships with so many of you. I've had tricky relationships with so many of you but I'm going to miss you guys. And like Shane Newton! I've got a lot of love for you guys. Picnics. Cake. Struggle. It's horrendous. Excited. Colourful. Anthropology. The gossips. All right. Great. Quiet. It's noisy. Waste man. They were actually discussing the colour of each other's Birkenstocks. We've come so far all together. Uh, a lot of stress and pressure, but we did well. I've enjoyed sick form and charter, and I'll miss it. I'm starting to think I'm actually going to miss it a bit. I think it's been a good year for all of us. Good luck for the future and all you're going to do. So I just wish them all the best. Um, you know, the world is your oyster, you can do it at 13.